Shakari Richardson of America has won the Women's 100m World Championship. Shakari Richardson, an American, outran a star-studded field to win the Women's 100m Global title on Monday, two years after a positive marijuana test ended her Olympic aspirations. Richardson, who finished in lane 9 while running on the far outside, matched the year's best time and set a world championship record with a timing of 10.65 seconds. She defeated Sharika Jackson of Jamaica by 0.07 seconds and Shelly Ann Fraser Price, a five-time champion, by 0.12. She informed the track announcer shortly after the race, I'm here, I told y'all. I'm better, I'm not back. Even though Richardson entered as the American champion and had defeated Jackson, who also has run 10.65 this year, the last two times they faced off in 2023, she was pegged as a 5-1 underdog in this, her first significant competition on the international stage. Four of the eight fastest runners in history participated in the event, including Marie-José Talou, who came in fourth. Richardson, 23, appeared startled as she crossed the finish line even though it was obvious that she had finished in front of all those competitors to her left in the gold medal race. She gave the sky a kiss, gazed at the stunning scoreboard, and then stumbled toward the stands to take the American flag and congratulations from Fraser Price, British Dina Asher-Smith, and others. What a turnaround tale, and it happened right before the Paris Olympics, which begin in less than a year. When Richardson swept to victory at the Olympic trials two years ago, she seemed poised to emerge as America's upcoming sprint star. However, she tested positive for marijuana, a doping violation she freely accepted, claiming she was in a terrible mood following the recent passing of her mother. As a result, her triumph was promptly wiped from the record. There was a heated discussion about whether marijuana, which is not a performance enhancer, truly belonged on the prohibited list, it still does, as well as if the authorities were overzealous in their pursuit of a young, vocal, black American lady. The authorities argued that everyone must go by the same regulations. Richardson made several unsuccessful comeback attempts before starting to round into form to begin 2023, finishing in an embarrassing last place during a much-hyped return a few weeks after the Tokyo Olympics. She exposed her soul in a live social media discussion around a year ago, pleading with others to discover their true selves just as she had. She also ended up on the track, where she caught everyone's attention when the largest race outside of the Olympics ended on Monday night. She was competing in a race alongside Jackson and Ta Lu in the so-called semifinal of death, where only the top two finishers would advance to the championship.